Last week, the city council repealed a strict set of rules for operating vacation rentals rather than put the question on the ballot. The council's rules would have allowed homeowners to rent their primary homes to vacationers, but no secondary homes. The rental home industry mounted a successful signature campaign that forced the repeal. With the new rules rescinded, City Councilwoman Barbara Bree says existing law bans vacation rentals and it should be enforced. And my office earlier today asked the mayor's office for an update on what they're doing about enforcing on some specific properties they were given. Vacation rentals are seen by some as nuisance properties. They also remove properties from the permanent rental market at a time when average rents have hit a record high. San Diego State economist Miro Kopik says short-term rentals are attractive to investors and vacationers who are looking for something cheaper than a hotel room. And I can use the kitchen, I could, you know, do whatever I can in this location, whereas in a hotel, I'm limited into what I do, and then I get charged for every incremental item. Mayor Faulkner says he's working to get stakeholders to compromise, and he expects to see the issue before the city council again in early 2019. Tom Fudge, KPBS News.